Ron Dayton is elected to the College Football Hall of Fame. It was a no-brainer, really, for the guy who rushed for more yards than any other runner in NCAA history. Dane had 7,125 rushing yards in his collegiate career and, of course, won the Heisman Trophy in the 1999 season. His number 33 was officially retired at the UW in 2007. Dane was always a soft-spoken man who let his results on the football field do the talking. This afternoon, he talked about what it means to be selected for the College Football Hall of Fame. I just can't stop smiling. You know, I'm just excited and I'm happy, you know, especially for me and, and my teammates. You know, we worked on it. We worked on it as a team. And uh, all the stuff that I'm getting and the stuff that I had got, it was from teamwork. And, uh, you know, and it's just great to be able to come back and, you're still getting awards. You know, that's one of the things that one of my well, my cousin had called me this morning. I was like, man, you're still getting awards and you ain't even playing football, you know? So I'm like, it's just great. For a lot of Badger fans, one of the most memorable sports moments they've ever had been a part of happened November 13th, 1999, when Dane passed Ricky Williams as the NCAA's all-time rushing leader in that memorable game against Iowa. Dane's coach, Barry Alvarez, was inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame in 2010. Today, he looks back on the great Dane's career. When you mention Wisconsin, I think they picture Ron carrying the ball and us running the ball. I think that that describes the brand of football that, that we established here, and that's how everybody pictures it. We said there are a lot of guys that played this game, and no one did what he did. Consistency over a four-year period uh, and staying healthy. You know, so I, I think he goes down as one of the greats that ever played college football to this date.